Predator Potion Outdoors. Badass bait that works. With a special thanks to our sponsors, Duke Traps, and of course, Oki Trap Supply. be continued all right we're out uh we're out northwest of town and my friend paul and megan they're having their chickens killed they got a rooster you might scan the chicken coop but people live here saw a coyote go through here last night or this morning i guess but paul called me and i'm out here i got i'm gonna put four sets in so i uh thought i was done trapping but i'm not so Anyway, we're gonna just have a bone set here and I've got a grass as a backing and then I'm gonna punch in a couple of punch holes, put my lure and bait in. So anyways, that's what we're doing. Hopefully we'll have a coyote. That me again. I'm picking up the, you going? Going. I'm picking up the feathers and I'm using feathers as attractors in my punch holes. So, um, definitely part of a dead chicken here, a dead rooster. So anyway, I'm gonna blend this in with some grass. And uh, I think we're ready to go. That's it, that's my flat set with a bone. So. I think we're gonna get one next night or two. So anyway, we're gonna walk around. I got four sets in here. So we're gonna walk around and I'll show you my other three sets. Probably set more than I needed, but uh, I wanna kill that coyote fast before he kills any more chickens and roosters. Okay. All right, here's a, another bone set. And I've actually got coyote tracks right here going right up to the chicken coop coming from the north so anyway there's one and then we made another dirt hole right here on the edge of the alfalfa field so that's the that's the first set i put in and i put in that and i got out here got kind of like a little washout on the alfalfa field and i've got another set right here so and i've got feathers in them and so we gotta get us a coyote next day or two. Well, this morning I got a call from the lady that lives out here. They're not the ones that own the chickens. But anyway, she called me, says, you got a coyote out here bouncing around. And sorry, my filming's not very good, I'm driving. Looky there. Ammo is excited. Ammo's real excited. He hasn't got to get on a coyote for a while. He's barking at us. I'm gonna let him loose. Go see what he can do here. Let's go see what Ammo's gonna do. We got a pretty good little confrontation going on there. Well, it took uh, three nights. But we got that coyote. Here's the chicken coop right here. You hear the chickens cackling. He really don't look too bad. I had a feeling I was gonna catch him in this set. Had a good dirt pattern here. He's kind of a vocal guy here this morning. Look at you. I've been trapping for about, oh, how long's it been? Six weeks now? Coyote and bobcat traps, kind of miss it. Been beaver trapping, but there just isn't anything like coyote trapping. And I got him hung up. 
and a Duke 650, whole foot catch. We can hear the chickens in the background the cackling. Beautiful morning. We're going to get this coyote put down, get this set remade, and uh, we'll be back at you. Beautiful morning, sun trying to come up. Boy, he's really vocal. Got his tail between his legs. I think he knows he's had it. He ate one too many chickens. Anyway, all right, we're gonna get him put down. I gotta get to get to work. Well, he's sure talking. I like these talkers. Makes it makes it interesting. Here's one of my other sets, about ten yards from the one we caught him. Look at this track right here. We just missed him there. I'm gonna walk over here and make sure my other sets are all right. Damn, he stepped right on top of this one too. There may be multiple coyotes here. Look like uh, this one got uncovered. We had a lot of wind the other day. So I'm gonna bring some more dirt over here. Oh, roosters are crowing, they're happy. like any tracks on the four sets so anyway there's our chickens and roosters all right dog down still pretty good looking coyote this is the last day of march female she won't be uh raising any pups this summer now thank goodness for the chickens anyway uh this is the uh finished set two punch holes it's kind of a modified flat set with a bone two punch holes two different baits potion number one potion number two and a little bit of a little bit of gland lure and then i got a clod right here on the other side with some urine on it so this is what we got chicken killer number one down we're gonna keep at it